Hey, what's up, guys? Econ Bulldog here. Welcome back to the channel. Econ Bullies out there. Appreciate you guys. Just wanted to say, if you watched my last video, you know I was super, super tired. I'm going to put the link right here. I think it was like 1 o'clock in the morning. Uh, I was just going in and wanted to film a video for you guys. I wanted to show my support as far as like tell you guys, uh, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Please like and comment, subscribe. Uh, really means a lot to me. Um, just to kind of give you an idea, um, you want to have different sources of income. Um, at the same time, I'm one to always help out family, you know, so I use my YouTube money to help out as much family as I can. That's just me personally. Um, right now, I have an uncle, you know, not long story short, I don't want to just tell you like a sob story or something, but, you know, they did cut off his toe. He's kind of going through a bad spot, got kicked out of his girl's house or something. And now, you know, I'm kind of just sending him money so he can, uh, you know, definitely, um, you know, get by. Right. He just texts me, um, hey, you know what? I just spent all this money on um, I'll show you guys real quick. I just, you know, um, I feel like, you know, we all go through it. You know what I mean? So, um, you know, he just said, hey, uh, you know, I just spent all this money on my guys, you know what I mean? He He's, you know, so I sent him some, some, some PayPal stuff, you know, PayPal money on the way. Um, and then that's another thing, right? So um, it's more of like PayPal credit. Um, I'm able to maximize my credit, use the YouTube money to pay for that and stuff like that. So if you're looking to help people, just, you know, be, be, be a good person. My uncle, what well, wasn't the best uncle growing up as far as like giving me value. He was always like a hard knock, um, always doing, you know, the wrong stuff, getting with the wrong people. But I feel like, you know, at the end of the day, you know, he raised me or he was there when I was a kid. And, you know, I'm sure he gave me things. I do remember when I went to Vegas, um, he was doing, he was washing dishes in Vegas and I went with my grandma. My grandma loved to gamble and uh, we went to go see my uncle. And I remember he was, he was, I mean, for when I looked, he was like, had some money, you know, and he, you know, he gave me like, you know, 20 bucks. But to me, as a eight year old, you know, 20 bucks seemed like a hundred. And, uh, you know, I really thought about that. I was like, you know, it's, I spent it all on, on on games and stuff like that at, at Circus, or I think it was Treasure Island, you know, but, you know, now I'm in a position where I can help him out. And I always have. Um, but yeah, sorry. Um, I just want to tell you guys, you know, please like, sub, um, comment and um, subscribe to the channel i'm going to give you guys in this video real quick how to remove a collection yeah the title said that so i'm gonna give you guys a gem it's video is going to be short quick simple um just follow the steps super super easy guys don't want to go too much intricate because i feel like some of you guys don't execute on the information so i want to go over that and um one second all right so Okay, hold on. All right, so real quick, guys. First things first. A lot of you guys that watch my channel, you know, I want you guys to execute on the information. Execute is key. All right, you guys absorb the info, write it down, execute, see the results, whether it's good or bad. All right, and then some of you guys that watch my channel, you'll throw a question and it has like 10 questions in one. Like, I don't mind answering one or two questions, but don't ask like 10 questions in one. Like you really need to understand, you know, value someone's time. Okay. So like I was saying, um, I don't mind helping people out. Hey, how do you remove this? You know, I have 20 inquiries. I have this collection. Hey, I said, did it work? Did it work for you? You know, just a lot of questions all in one. And I'm just like, whoa, you know, sometimes, um, you know, obviously I want to get to a point where I'm helping more people. You know, that's why you can always text the number there. Credit, you know, we got you. And, um, you know, going back to this. All right, so real quick. Now, absorb info, write it down, execute results. Absorb info, write it down, execute results. Simple. All right. Delete a collection. All right. If you fall behind on payments, a lender or creditor may transfer your collection account to a collection agency or sell it to a debt buyer. Now, realize that sometimes 
it might take 90 days for them to do that. It might take 120 days, right? There's no real set time. So sometimes the payments will accrue um, before it falls into a collection. All right. If you fall behind on the payments, hey, it happens, right? So now if you have like three or four late payments, now it's easier to remove that account because those late payments will hurt you if they're fresh. If they're like four or five years old, they won't affect you as much on your credit. All right. Now, next one. Okay. Collections are not agreements between you and the collection agency. So technically they buy your debt for pennies on the dollar, but there's no real formal agreement between you and that company. Would you agree? So my, you know, if my understanding or the way I want to, you know, just interpret it and I help other people interpret it, it's kind of like if they bought the debt for pennies on the dollar, who owes the debt? Comment below, right? If they buy the debt from a company, now they're trying to make me pay for it. But who owes the debt? They bought it, so technically they own it. They just want me to pay whatever I owe, right? And um, yeah, that's the key. They bought the debt for pennies on the. They might have bought a thousand dollar loan debt for probably like fifty bucks. Because what these collection agencies do is they go to these companies. Hey, I want to buy your debt. So how much you owe? Okay, cool. That's like there's like. Let's say there's hundreds. Okay, I'll give you a number. I'll buy all these for X amount. I'll buy all these for 10,000, right? And now that's like probably like, it could be 150,000 in there. And now with these collection companies, they're good at calling you, calling you, calling you, and trying to collect that debt, all right? So it's just part of the game, okay? All right, so real quick, go on Experian, Experian.com. You can do this with all the ones. I'm just going to go over Experian, okay? Go on Experian, go all the way down, go to Help Center, click File Dispute, Dispute Center, click Start a Dispute, go to the Account, go to the Collection, click on the Collection, and then put this. I have not supplied proof under the Doctrine of Estoppel by Silence. Engelhart versus Gravens, 281-SW-715-719. I presume that no proof of the alleged debt, nor therefore any such debt, in fact, therefore exists. OK, so when you're trying to verify, like, OK, please show me proof that I owe this debt, they have to send you proof. And nine out of 10 times, I would say even more than that, they, they don't show proof. They just say the account has been verified. Well, show me agreement that I did with this company and I want the original contract. Right. And they don't they're they don't have it. Or they just bought the debt, but they didn't buy all that information behind it. Okay? So, guys, real quick, do me a favor. Like, subscribe, and comment. Just try it. Execute on the information. I'm not just here to give out free info and for you to watch and not execute. All right? That's my main concern. Okay? Remember, absorb info, write it down, execute results. Okay? Now, if you're watching my video, I want... 10 people to join my private mentorship that I'm having. All right. It's not going to break the bank, but just realize in this mentorship, we're looking to clean your credit and give you at least $50,000 in credit with the right banks. If you're interested in that DME Latino solutions mentorship, we can put you on a payment plan. We'll just make it work for you. Get in the program. It'll be zoom calls. It'll be growth. It'll be how to fix your credit personally and then get this bag with these other um with other banks okay hey appreciate you guys tap in with me econ bulldog econ bullies out there you guys have been certified also shout out to mis desmadres right want the shirt made drug dealer quitter entrepreneur right there hit her up link is in the description um and if you get a shirt from her i'll hook you up with credit repair the first month i'll give you a good deal but you have to get an item from there, from her. So if you get like two shirts or something, she'll make them, send them to you. And then that's how we grow. All right, guys. Appreciate you. You can't bold like this should be the most fire video. Come on, guys. Let's get it more than to 20,000 views. That's my best one so far. Guys, if you really like 
want to inspire someone else, show them this video, guys. Show them this video. All right, let's get it.